Ooh, this looks all good, doesn't I, it? I you like it when all of a sudden breakfast shows up on the news set. I know, you know? especially for how early we get here. We yeah, don't get right? to have breakfast, yeah. so mm -hmm. anybody that brings some food, we're already excited. Okay, <laughs> so this help. is former Olympic athlete turned cold chain entrepreneur Jamie Moriarty, and he's here to show us just how valuable the freezer and cold food aisle can be when it comes to busy families who are also looking for healthy options. And he joins us today for a weekend brunch and will show us a healthy and convenient brunch plus breakfast alternatives, including you got some chicken and also waffles, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. Some bacon, back bacon, sausage, some waffles, uh, bagels, um, you know, and, and the great thing about all of this food is it's all not what you'd expect. There's more protein in the waffles and the bagels than you'd expect. Double sometimes, you know, the, the bagels, for example, have five eggs worth of protein wow. in them. Wow. Uh, the bacon, which is a traditional, uh, you know, uh, back bacon, uh, British bacon, um, you know, it's lean. It's leaner than our, our American mm -hmm. bacon. This is from Jolly Posh. We've got Bonza, uh, Better Brand Bagels. And then, uh, you know, just to, to top it off, we've got some Twisted Alchemy fresh pressed. Uh, cold press, so it's hand squeezed uh, juice, 100% juice. You could uh, make a mimosa, you could do a, a mocktail. So a lot of great choices here. I'm all for that. I am too. I, I got a lot of questions here. Mm -hmm. One, oh, so you were a bobsledder. Mm -hmm. How mm -hmm. did you make that transition from bobsledding to finding yourself being a cold chain entrepreneur? And what does that mean? Yeah. yeah so, uh, yeah, I, you know, I actually, crazy enough, I started in food. I went to Cornell University where I, I majored in uh, hotel and restaurant management. So okay. I started in food, but, but then continued on with my athletics and uh, just kind of, uh, you know, as things kind of occur in life, you know, you, you find your way. I was always an entrepreneur and found an opportunity in, uh, in, in shipping fresh and frozen food. So what we do is, is we like to partner with brands like this. We do their e-commerce fulfillment. So go on their website, um, eatbonza.com. You place an order for the, the protein waffles. We're the ones receiving that order and shipping it out to your door. Got it. So it's important to have uh, higher protein. Obviously, the less fat is good. Mm -hmm. But the, so these are all relatively healthy choices. They are, yeah, and unexpectedly so. Like I said, um, you know, if you look at the, the better bagels, you know, those have the equivalent of five eggs worth of protein in it. Obviously, as you know, protein's a, a great macronutrient for health. Um, you're, you're just getting a lot of better choices from the frozen aisle, which is not what you'd expect. It's not your grandparents' right. frozen meals of the well, past. Well, because traditionally, you know, we're yeah. always told to avoid the frozen mm -hmm. aisle right. and go mm -hmm. right for the, the fresh, you right. know? Right, right. And uh, you're able to bring the fresh to the frozen, it sounds Exactly. Like. Yeah, the freezer section is completely different than what it used to be. You really are able to lock in freshness. You, even if you're talking about fruit, you're able to actually pick that fruit at its, at its peak and flash freeze it right away so you get the nutrients and then the convenience of it could sit in your freezer. You don't have to worry worry about it spoiling mm -hmm. and uh, you could pull it out when you need it. You know, one of the things that we hear a lot, uh, especially in the news now, is the price of food. Right. When you go oh, well, and mm -hmm. you, you, you know, ring it up and you're yeah. like, whoa, this is not how much I used to pay. Mm -hmm. Is this affordable for families at the same time? It is, you know, and I think one of the reasons why it is affordable is because you can buy in bulk, um, you know, so you're, you're saving on the unit economics, mm -hmm. right? And then also you don't have to go back to the store all these different mm. times to, to refill. So while you're there, pick up a few extra bags or, or packets and stick them in your freezer and they're gonna last. Makes okay, sense. you've got this we bacon taste. that you we yeah, oh, the taste. Bacon is I've delicious. gotta taste the bacon, so, uh, you know, fork that on Here over here. Yeah. And, right. and what did you call this? This is a this is this is back bacon. Back, back bacon, bacon. Yes, from Jolly Posh Foods. And it uh, comes from not is, the front, but the the back. Is that what's going on <laughs> yeah, here? I mean, you know, why, why do they call it back yeah. bacon? Uh, you know, I'm I am the not the front or the back. Yeah, right? yeah, Only the, Mark would I'm ask the, you that. I'm not the chef, so I'm I, not. I just wondered, you know, if like the front bacon was right. different than know. the back, you know. Yeah, Very and like good. I said, this is leaner, so it's lightly does seasoned. Does look lean, yeah. Um, and uh, it's got less than half the fat of our, you know, American mm -hmm. bacon. Okay, so what else you got? Because chicken and waffles was was the line that got me. Okay, okay. In. Well, let's get you some waffles. So mm. we've got Bonza waffles right here. Okay. Um, Want a waffle? These are blueberry. <laughs> Yes, I'll take what, something to drink. Cause it, oh, let's you know, do that. Let's do after that. Drinking the back, <laughs> eating the back bacon is right. hard to talk the it's rest good. of the show. It is good. Here, let's get you some. But a little, little mm. mocktail. Mm. Mm -hmm. You ready to mock it up? <laughs> <laughs> and I can open the syrup. The syrup is no, good. Absolutely. Okay. You want. absolutely. Okay. Well, I just you know so I didn't want to just. The show here, too. We've got grapefruit. <laughs> I didn't we've want to just take over. Pineapple. We've got pomegranate. What kind do you want? Blood orange. Um, He's gonna go pineapple, maybe. Um, yeah, uh, orange sounds good. Yeah. Orange, oh, pineapple. Okay. Pineapple. Says pineapple. Whichever. Pineapple. Who cares? Yep. Right. You know, yep. he, he just needs some tomato. To, tomato. To yep. Wash it down. Mm -hmm. um, I'll take whatever you mix yeah. up for me. All right. This is uh, from Twisted Alchemy. 
Okay, is that, and, and where can I find that? On your website as well? This, this or is when I go to their all, website? Yeah, all of their websites, so twistedalchemy.com. And uh, like <clears> I said, this is 100% juice. Um, you know, it's, it's used a lot with, uh, there you go. Oh, so look at this that. is with, alcohol uh, in this or no this alcohol? This is no alcohol. So this okay. is 100% juice. I put in a little seltzer water, but it's used a lot in cocktails, you know, so uh, great juices for cocktails. Uh, obviously, we did a mocktail today. but Very tasty. That's pretty good. I yeah. feel like we're having brunch. Yes, we, we yeah. are. Like know? breakfast at Tiffany's or something. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty good, isn't it? It's, it's, it's we've pretty got, spectacular. If you want, we could do a little ready whip. Do you guys want ready whip or anything? Go ahead. Throw a little right. something on. Oh, I mean, I normally wouldn't do it, but up. why not? All right, come on. We're here. That's not over here because here's how I do with uh, whipped cream, you know, we're just, you Oh, know. absolutely. Oh, yeah. Man, my God. My own heart. It's, it's some good stuff right there. Thank you for yeah. coming on yeah, our show. Absolutely. It was Thanks a pleasure having, having you here. I got to quit touching you. My husband will say something when I go home. Um, again, thank <laughs> you for a being sweater. here. You can touch him all you want. <laughs> yeah, he's pretty buff too. All right, we'll be right back after this break. Don't get me in trouble, Jerry. <laughs>